The Bravest Dog. St. Bernard dogs have been used for many years in the Swiss Alps. The dogs have been trained to rescue people lost in the mountains. The most famous St. Bernard rescue dog was Barry. One day, the wind in the Alps began to howl. The snow fell faster and faster. Suddenly, a deep rumbling sound could be heard. A great avalanche began. Soon, the radio announced the news. A little boy was lost. Barry, come! A little boy is lost in the snow. We must find him quickly. No! No! Come on, Barry. Let's find that little boy. No! No! Barry and his master struggled against the wind and snow. Finally, Barry's master was too cold. He could not go any farther up the mountain. Oh, the snow is too terrible, and it's too deep for me. Suddenly, the master realized that he could not see Barry. Barry, Barry, where are you? Oh no, I have lost him. The harsh storm made the master unable to see very far ahead. Finally, the master found some lights in the woods. I have to rest in that nearby cabin. Then I will have more energy to start searching again. Barry's master began to walk toward the cabin. Barry could not see his master, but Barry kept searching for the boy anyway. Barry struggled as he walked into the deeper and deeper snow. The wind and snow blew even stronger, and now the sky was beginning to get dark. Oh, I am so hungry! Oh no! The sun is going down now. The snow is getting deeper too. But I must find that little boy. Barry walked and walked some more. He sniffed the air. He sniffed the snow. Suddenly, Barry stopped. I know that smell. It is a human. Surely, I have found the little boy. Barry began to dig. He barked as he dug his paws deeper and deeper into the snow. Barry dug faster and faster. He dug quickly but very carefully now. I must not hurt the boy as I dig. Ah, here is the boy's face. Oh no, he is very pale. Barry continued to dig carefully around the boy's body. Now, little boy, you are free from the snow. But the boy did not open his eyes. The huge dog kept barking and licking the small boy's face over and over again. Wake up, little boy. You must get up out of the snow. But the little boy did not move. So Barry spread his body over the little boy to warm him up, and he licked the boy's face some more. Barry carefully put the boy's coat in his large mouth. Then he pulled the child out of the snow. The boy could not walk. 
He could not even stand up, so Barry carried him by the coat. Barry's body shielded the little boy from the harsh winter wind. Soon, Barry saw a cabin. He carried the little boy to the door of the cabin. Mom, mom, let us in! I have found the lost little boy. The door swung open widely. Oh, Barry, you found the little boy. Barry's master took the little boy and put him on the rug by the fire. He took good care of the boy. The boy was fully awake now. No other rescue dog could have found this little boy in the terrible storm and avalanche. You are the bravest rescue dog of all. Barry was a working dog. His breed was Saint Bernard. He was the most famous rescue dog in history. Barry was a rescue dog for twelve years and worked in the Swiss Alps. He rescued over forty people, including the little boy in this story.